Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever found yourself analyzing price charts and wishing you could easily spot where trading sessions begin and end, today's tutorial is just what you need. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to add session breaks in TradingView for 2024, making it easier to identify market opens and closes, a super helpful tool for both day traders and long-term investors who want to see those transitions clearly. Let's jump right in and take this step by step so you're not left guessing at any point. First things first, let's head over to TradingView, that's our main workspace for chart analysis. If you haven't used TradingView before, just open your browser and go to TradingView.com. Once you're in, you'll see a range of options, but don't get distracted by the bells and whistles. We're staying focused on adding those session breaks. Look for the Products tab at the top of the homepage. This is where TradingView groups all its main features, charts, screeners, and more. Give it a click so you're looking at the grid-style view of the different products. Sometimes this grid can look pretty busy, but don't worry, all we need to do here is right-click anywhere on that grid view. It might seem a little odd, but right-clicking is how you get to those deeper settings that aren't always visible at first glance. Once the menu pops up after your right-click, search for Settings. This is your control center for making all kinds of chart tweaks in TradingView. Click on Settings and then move over to the Events section. The Event tab is where TradingView lets you manage things like earnings announcements, splits, dividends, and also, if available, session breaks. Now here's a moment where you might have to be a bit patient. Scan the options and look for anything labeled session break or similar. If you see it, that's fantastic, you're almost done. But sometimes, depending on your current chart interval, the option just doesn't show up. Maybe you're viewing a daily or weekly chart and TradingView doesn't offer session breaks for that time frame. But don't worry, this is super common. If you run into this issue and don't see the session break setting, hear what you do. Change your chart's interval to a shorter one, switch it to minutes, like 1 minute, 5 minute, or 15 minute intervals. Session breaks are usually most relevant and visible on intraday charts because that's when markets open and close during the trading day. Think of it like zooming in from a wide landscape shot to a close-up, you start to see the detail that wasn't visible before. To change the interval, just look for the bar where your time frame is displayed, click it, and select a minute-based interval. Now go back and repeat the process. Right-click on the grid view again, head into Settings, then Event, and this time you should see the Session Break option. If it pops up, go ahead and enable it. This will add vertical lines or markers on your chart, showing exactly where each trading session starts and ends. Having these visual cues can help you spot key moves that happen around the open and close, or help you avoid trading during less liquid periods. And that's really all there is to it. You've now added session breaks to your TradingView chart, making it so much easier to keep track of trading activity throughout the day. If you get stuck or don't see the option, just double check your interval settings and make sure you're on one of those minute based timeframes. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and drop any questions you have in the comments below. I love helping out and chatting with you all. And if you want more step-by-step -step guides like this on TradingView and other trading tools, remember to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. Happy trading and I'll see you in the next one.